Good evening, guys. Silver 5150 here back on the Silver 5150 channel with <laughs> the 2020 Chinese Panda. And I gotta tell you guys, I have some pandas. I love pandas, but I'm gonna tell you, these right here are really hard to get. Um, I think it's because of a lot of the tariff stuff that's coming out of the White House against China. China's sitting there going, okay, fine, you know, you guys are gonna make it difficult for us. We're not going to share a lot of things with you. And they're sitting there kind of holding back some of the goods and services probably that we get uh, from them routinely just you know playing this game tip for tat but we're not here to talk about politics we're here to talk about the 2020 panda standard on the back for the chinese uh, uh mint i guess they you know have those symbols up there one of these days i'll figure out what they are and i'll tell you but until then you're gonna have that temple on the back which is a very beautiful design i think that actually that temple is different for 2020 compared to the ones for the last four or five years so we'll look into that later but let's talk about what they're trying to play at with these new pandas. Now, you guys remember in 2019, the uh, the theme for the Chinese panda was the mama and the baby. And oh my gosh, it was so cute. And even in some of the proper series right now, you have like the parent and baby theme going. The Mandalorian, of course, the Mandalorian and the baby Degaman, I guess Yoda, is in there stealing the show. And now this year, they're just going for this all-out cute culliness. Guys, okay, let's be honest. Yes, pandas do have a cute factor to them, but have you ever seen a live one, like a male, close up? It's a bear, okay? It's a bear, and it could probably smack your face clean off your body. But they are gentle giants. They do love their um, leaves. I don't know what kind of leaves those are. I know that the uh, koala bears love the eucalyptus leaves. But in any case, um, this is the 2020... Chinese panda, 30 grams as always, three nines pure as always, 10 yuan um, as is typical, and um, just a beautiful coin altogether. Silver 5150 channel, we collect these coins um, because we want to travel one day to a lot of places and stuff. In this case, we're going to try to use these when we get to mainland China or probably even in Hong Kong or uh, what do you call it, Beijing. But um, we do this because we feel that currencies around the globe are starting to devalue. There's going to be some crazy stuff happening here in the next couple of weeks um, with all the stuff going on in American banks. And then, of course, you got Deutsche Bank over in Germany that's having a lot of problems. And now people are heading to bullion banks to buy gold and silver bullion in mass numbers because they can sense there's something wrong with the currency system as it is right now. Well, no worries for people that are close to silver 5150 because he's got them all covered. These coins are going to be for me to travel with my friends and my family. Um, they may have the means at the time to go. I'm not going to be concerned with that. I'm going to be like, hey, who can go? Who's not scared to go? Because I like people that are not afraid to travel. I know a lot of younger um, uh, lady friends that are in either in family, either their relatives or, you know, they're just, you know, friends that love to travel. I call them travel bugs. You know, in a lot of cases, they don't usually have a lot of money, but they love to travel. <laughs> That's the way it is, <laughs> especially with some of the millennial uh, kids out there. So um, these coins are going to be for that, um, for traveling and uh, for having fun and to do some business with my investment group. We're thinking about doing that later. Hmm. Now this is Machu Picchu in, I think, what, in the Caribbean. And so Machu Picchu is some ancient ruins. There's a mountain there at the sunlight and stuff. And this is something that's in a brochure right now. But look at those old ruins. I mean, who wouldn't want to go travel to Machu Picchu? I wouldn't want to climb those right there. I don't know what kind of uh, terraformed steps those are. But anyway, look at that beautiful grassy valley there. You know there's bugs all over the place there because it's in the tropics. But just exploring those ruins. Why wouldn't you want to go there and check that out? You know, take some videos and pictures and stuff with some friends and shed up with some friends and then go down and have like some Brazilian barbecue or whatever the hell, you know, they're eating. Uh, in any case, Silver 5150 channel, man, we like to collect and dream, save our money in silver and gold, and, uh, and prepare for a um, fun time uh, amongst ourselves and with the Monkey King. Did I bring him up again? By the way, I think he's Chinese, even though they met him in Australia. Just having fun, guys. All right, enjoy, and uh, always remember, never let anyone tell you to feel bad about your stack, you know, because there's nothing bad about having a stack. Always continue stacking and enjoy it and know you're doing the right thing. You'll be ready for the future, as will us. So 5150 channel, if you like this kind of content, please like, share, and subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. And I found out that if you don't subscribe by clicking the bell, you have to tap the bell to get the notifications. You won't get the notifications. 
My niece told me that. So, um, yeah, go ahead. When you subscribe, hit the bell there to uh, get the notifications when we post another video. And we'll see you next time.